The amazing moment that a deaf toddler hears for the first time thanks to device implanted in his brain. This is the moment a deaf 17, month, old boy was able to hear for the very first time. Surrounded by his family, toddler Alex Frederick looks up as he hears the sound of keys banging on a table. It is the first sound little Alex, Washington Township, Michigan, has ever heard after he was born two months premature and unable to hear, according to ABC News. The little boy however, who weighed just 4 pounds and 4 ounces when he was born and also has a heart condition, was able to hear for the first time after he was fitted with an a pioneering brainstem implant Alex's father Phil discovered the existence of the device as he looked for an answer to his son's deafness after an attempt to fit a cochlear implant failed. The technology, which has been pioneered in Italy, was due to undergo clinical trials in the U.S. in a bid to win FDA approval. Alex had the device fitted in a five-and-a-half-hour operation at the Massachusetts Eye and Ear Infirmary in Boston in October last year he then returned to the hospital in November to have the device switched on. His parents had initially wanted the first sound he heard to be his sister's voices, but he did not react after they started talking. After several attempts to make louder noises, Alex finally looked up when a doctor banged a set of keys on the table his mother Stephanie said, he stopped everything that he was doing and he looked. His father Phil meanwhile said, I knew, he was completely focused on his toy and then he just, he looked in August last year, I reported how Finn Johnson, who had been unable to hear or speak, traveled to Italy where he underwent a brainstem implant. Within a month of the surgery, the youngster, born in January 2011, was able to hear his parents' voice for the first time and he has now spoken his first word. His grateful mother Natalie Nixon, 24, from Hardwick, T's side, said, Finn is doing really well now. He's just said his first word ma'am and we've videoed it. It's wonderful. Around 1,000 people in the world have auditory brain stem implants, which were first used in humans in 1979. Only a handful of surgeons around the world perform the complex neurological procedure. It involves surgeons implanting a microchip into the patient's brain stem so they can recognize and process sound. The technology is similar to that of a cochlear implant, using electrical stimulation, the brain stem implant uses electrical impulses to stimulate the brain, rather than the cochlea. Most recipients of the implant only have an awareness of sound. It's described as being able to hear the beat, but not the melody. After being implanted, the device needs to be reprogrammed by specialists regularly as electrodes can overlap with other parts of the brain stem, causing tingling in other parts of the body.